a speech a lesson concerning the adagio of the sonata number one from the 12th sonata opus one and um, a sonata very famous it exists exists uh, a, a version um, for two recorder a duo the same note but with some little difference because two alto sometimes the second is higher of the first so the composer has to be careful with the fifth the fourth and other things um, in this version from um, the, that I think is the original one uh, Loyer start with the basso continuo with the cello with the harpsichord or what alone and um, so we listen the the theme the theme done by the the basso boom, 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 boom. We can listen it. Okay, and here start the recorder, what's interesting to us, because we are not studying harpsichord or cello, but recorder. It's not easy, the start of the recorder, because it is starting with the lower A. And A is not a good note in alto recorder, treble recorder. It has no force, and normally there is a too low of tune. So when you start with this piece, you have, to, you have to know this and then try to make the, with, with the most sound as possible. If you see in the video, I, I blow having the, the cheek that's, that's make like ballon, uh, this help for arriving at the limit of the instrument because before that you broken the note your chick guance will uh, will tell you what will happen and so you can stop the the pressure before that you broke the note and uh, but it's not easy it's not easy after this, the notes are very easy. This is one of the most easier sonata that I know from for alto recorder and basso continuo. Uh, it's better if you are counting the um, the quarter and not the eighths, because if you count the eighths, pa 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 pa. There is too, too many accent and too many strong position. That's not true. Um, when you have two eights, one is important and one is light. Ta 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 ta. So ta 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 Okay. There is a lot of possibility of interpretation. Uh, not really for, for the tema, what can you do? Yes, you can decide if the G sharp is related with the A before or with the A after. Or Um, of course, but I think in the in the first announce of this tema, the first time that you do this tema, you have not to make a lot of problem of interpretation. We will listen what I did. Mm -hmm. 
Yes. My first note of bar five uh, 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 arrives a little later than the cembalo, but this is the problem when you have a bass that you recorded before. But when you recorded something, you have some idea of the tempo. Bum, bum. But when you play, probably it could be because you have more note or you have less note that you have another different idea of tempo. If you play directly together, we can see each other and normally the bass follow the flute. But if the flute plays a second, it has to follow a bass that has been recorded and fixed before, it happens that sometimes, for example, I think that the playing recorder I did the, four, the first note more long, instead of I did this is a good idea, but the bass was not listening to me because it was recorded before, so the bass arrived before me. After this, we can say without interpretation, just a good sound, uh, without silence, not... No, it's not the moment for making this. Not legato, but similar a legato, with tonguing, but similar a legato. But after this start some interpretation, if I could remember, I did... This pair of notes. We will listen. Yeah, but without silence, I didn't make... This was the idea, but the sound is continuing. Okay, just because it's the beginning, without ornaments, is not obligatory, but normally, normally it's better when you start to make something to make it without ornament, just for telling the note that the composer wrote. If you start and... Well, you are a good recorder player, but it's a little too much what you will do after. Normally in music we start with simple things and then the second time that we make the same, we make a little more complicated, and the third time or we make more and more complicated. This is for us is important, but also for the listener. So I started with a very simple version. You know, E, D, C, you can make but I did with just the, the, the first E a little longer. Ta -da -da. It's a little more pathetic. It's a little more interesting for the lead. Instead of ta da da, ta da da. Okay. E, F. E, F, G, F. It's an ornament of E, but you can consider also like a mordente superiore of F, but it's before the note. Ta -da -da -da. And this is the same, but lower. Instead of G sharp A B A, I did G sharp A G sharp A. So not the same ornaments.
here I did nothing. Uh, with a, a couple CD. Tara. I pronounce it Turu. Turu, tu. And then trill upon B. Long and trying to make force the maximum possible in this lower A and not something without quality, without sound. And then the bass make the same theme of the beginning and the recorder repeats. So start again. We can say that it's starting again. Okay, here the ornaments augment. A, B, A, trill with resolution. Altogether is not easy. A, B, A. And then trill with resolution. This could be without, but it's more related, not easy for the finger. Uh, B and after trill before B. But without tonguing, not but is uh, something mo with more note that when you make a gruppetto. B C B A C B C B A B C is gruppetto with the first note. Simple gruppetto is gruppetto with the, the first note, the written one before. And then this became a trill. Okay, I have to stop, I continue after. Bye bye. Okay, we were telling about an ornament upon B, and we will listen what happened with the G sharp. It could be that it's happened the same. What is important to observe is the, the reason because I did an ornament upon B and G sharp, I, I suppose G sharp. I don't remember, is two reasons. The first is because these notes are in a not strong position. So strong, light, strong. We make the ornaments, in this case, with the, in the light note. Boom, boom, boom. First. And second, because the relationship between light and heavy, B, C, G sharp, A, is Half, half tone, half tone, and this is make more interesting the ornamentation. We will listen. Ah, okay, it's interesting. I did an ornament in the first G sharp, G sharp A and in B, C, but not in the last G sharp A. I could do the opposite, so make nothing in the first G sharp. Or three times, but normally three times is too much. And now, E, D, C, we will listen. This is an interesting ornament. I, I tell you with number. Three, one, uh, three, two, one. The ornament is three, four, two, three, one.
if there is five note descending we make the note and the note higher so not in the C because this ornament is when you are going from one note to another but C is not going to another C is the end so and then after there is this uh, interesting 30 seconds that is a little unusual in this piece probably unique so I think I my interpretation is that probably this part is very pathetic very, with a, with a, um, with a special pathetic sense so I, I did the, the dotted D longer and the dotted F longer we will see Hey, basta! Okay. I, I will... Uh, my dog are playing together to make some noise. Then the normal note and for making A, stop A, B and then trill A, G sharp, A, B when it is and why a C? because C is the first note of the trill so A, B is not going to a B this is not good it's going to a C And with G sharp, we will listen. Nico. The trill is done in the same way of the trill an octave lower that was in bar 7. And this. B, C, an ornament that we see before, B, C, D, C, and then these four eights, these four eights make with, uh, with the making a pair. Tiri, tiri. This is because four eights are a little monotone, are not t t t t t. There is a little poor. So we, we have tried to make or ornaments or interpretation. The interpretation of this pair. Um, tara, tara, ta is one of the most used interpretation when you have some uh, slow note very very simple very easy instead of ta 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 it's make more give more important and the note it's more pathetic more expressive And this is difficult. A, B, C, and then A of the trill. It's dangerous to start the trill with the second position of A because it could be a little different of the A, normal A before. But it's dangerous to, to start with an, a real A and then to move two fingers for making the, the fake G 
because it could be that you don't move good these two fingers. This flute that I'm using here, using here, make the second position of A quite identical of the first position. So I can make this risk to start the trill with the second position of A. And then it's arriving an episode that for understanding we have to play or listen the two voice because bar 13 the flute make G it is consonant with E and C on the bass but after the bass go to an A and this A is dissonant with the G so my our long G start consonant and finish dissonant then is the same of F the start consonant F A and finish dissonant F G and the E start consonant G E G and finish dissonant E F. So this is typical when you have a note long that is tied legata with a note short normally in the moment in which arrive the, the second note or the short one Arrive also arrives also the dissonance. Uh, what we have to do with we start consonant and we finish dissonant? We have to improve the note messa di voce. Ta ta for underline the the dissonance and for avoiding the the mistake of tuning because if you blow more the note will be out of tune normally we move the finger we make flat mom or we make just a vibrato we will listen what happened uh, upon the F This is the beginning of a sonata from Endel. It's a difficult trill make with thumb. Upon F. because there is trill upon D. And then G, C. Uh, when you have a fourth, you can make G, A, G, C or G, F, sharp, G, C. Or both. G, A, G, F sharp, G. I think that I did G, A, G. We will listen. Oh, probably. My intention was to make both. But I, I, I recognize it as no time, so I started G, A, G. When you are playing in a concert or record or something, you have to recognize when you are doing something wrong and stop before. If I did G, A, G, F sharp, G, I will arrive at C too late. So I make G, A, G, C, G, A, G, C. Two things, the note in the middle of the third 
and then a mordente. Slow. We will listen again. Probably the second time I did it. D, D, E, F. Not in the first, but I could do it also in the, four, in the first, because this C, D, E is an ornament not of C, but of E. used by Bach. Terra, the third. And then four notes, that is the uh, like a mirror of the four notes in bar 12. And here we will listen what I did. Um, a lot of things. that we still met E F G F G F E F G Okay and then trill But not there is 4.16. I did more long the F, like a syncope. Not this, but the, this was the direction. It's something that arrived from Doland, from... Uh, music one century before that I think it's very elegant to put to make more long the note that's in a very weak position the second sixteen and now the tema in uh, in C it's strange but the cembalo seems to be out of tune but the Cembalo is electronic, cannot be off tune, so probably is the recorder that is out of tune. The C is too high, probably. Okay, an appoggiatura with mordente. F D E F D D and the version more elaborated F D D D so it's written appoggiatura is appoggiatura with mordente or we will listen Alt tone B C more uh, gruppetto the same position the same situation of bar sixteen four eighths C E D C but make more longer the E The same exact position of sixteenth. 
not that there is a mistake in the score the 2D in the second half of the bar are to be tied this is very strange so you can underline this ta with the legatura trill starting with B and then a part that is not so easy for the recorder because in the lower register it's not easy to have sound in this part the, the bass make the tema in G sharp before in bar 17 it was in C sharp and not G sharp G major and in bar 17 it was C major if you come back at the beginning the beginning is in A minor the theme and this is major okay try to make sound in this lower note and then we have six uh, sixteenths and make three pair of course after has to be the same but I did an ornament that derived this one from the original book, from the music of the beginning of the 17th century. We are in A minor, there is a G sharp, but I can make a natural G if in the same time of G sharp, there's something that Parcel, for example, use a lot. When it is E, D, C, B, E, F, G, F, E, D, C, B, C, A. We will listen. It's an ornament that I like very much. BC no B C D C when you have a sixth It's a, it's a very pathetic uh, distance. Da -di, this is minor six. You can make a gruppetto on the lower note, a gruppetto with alb tone, so A, B flat, A, G sharp. It's uh, what I did. F this is a, a major sixth like Libiamo but G sharp is the sensibility the seventh note of E minor where there is normal a trill so I did E lower E lower B B sixteenth B and A of trill Let's make this jump more interesting because it's a seventh. Da and short E. Probably for explaining very well that this important of this first group of da -da -da. if I did probably the F, the group of 16 
add less important. And now we have to understand that the bass make in contratempo. Boom, 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 boom. So it's important what the flute is making in the tempo. A flute in the making in the tempo some legatura. It's not easy to understand this part because what is telling um, Leye? This was possible, but if we did this, no one not the bass and not us a recorder player, we recorder player, make an accent when there is the, the, the beat. So I think that we have to make the third note very light and put all the sound and the importance in this very, very pathetic, like something crying. Ah. Ah, ah, okay, we will listen. Tarata 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 hand at the four quarter of bar twenty seven. Now the the accent are normal, so we have to know that something is changing. And in bar twenty eight, I did an A dotted A. Just a choice of test. And then there is something related at the beginning of the piece. We will listen. A, B, A, and then trill. For going to B to C, we can make C, uh, B, D, C or B, C, D, C and what I did but not with the long B pam, para, pam. but with the long D more elegant I could make the same, but was probably a little boring. E, D, and then trill upon C. For going from E to F, E, G, F, very simple way. We can make something very complicated, or I decided to make just the text. With the trill upon B, of course, and then a long mordente upon the last A. The problem of this mordente is that they have to do not with G natural, but with G sharp. 
Okay, I hope it has been, it has been useful. Bye bye.